Okay, now we got a little better understanding. Um, after going down this clean out, we now realize the clean out leads us not to that pump station. The only thing on that pump station is these other houses. This clean out currently leads over here, and then under the shed, one foot ten inches deep, the back side of the shed. Heads out the front, the front of the shed, and ties into the main. Now, there is a structure down here in front of this place that that pump station pumps into this structure. When this structure is full, because the main is full, because that is full, because that is full, because that is full, that's when we're tripping the breaker. There's gotta be something going on over here, I'm assuming. Oh, and the light's off now, so that means that the, the pump may have even turned off. We'll check it tonight sure the pump turns on Maybe it had just gotten overwhelmed, but the bolts are working okay. See the water level is going down. Hmm. I wonder if maybe maybe when we had all that snow melt and all this rain. It may have washed back from the leach field. It may have washed back to here and not let anything come through. Hmm. That is potential. That is potential. I think this is where the distribution box is, but I'm not for certain. No, there's a pipe. I think there's a pipe there. <sighs> yeah, I mean, we could also keep an eye on it during the wet. When it gets real wet, we'll uh, come out here and make sure maybe it has a leach field issue. It didn't seem like that was going off when we arrived. When we And the water level was down in this one and it was up in this one, so it wasn't getting to here. I think maybe we just overwhelmed it when we started putting lots of water into it and that's when the alarm went off. I don't think they have a leach field issue. I really don't because Yeah, because actually that was a top float that was up, so the alarm was going off on that one. Would still have a leach field issue. And then, uh, hey, will you grab the probe for me? Hey, hey, you grab the probe, probe, probe. It's not the floats over there because that we do. I haven't had it not turn off the pump yet. So it's, at first I was kind of iffy and I thought so, but nah, I'm not feeling so so much now. Now that we have a better understanding of the pipe. There's a lot of water there that might also be taking a lot of water here and dumping it into the system, causing it to overwhelm. 